Hey guys, this is your Sue and you review the LEGO Star Wars First Order Specialist Battle Pack. And yeah, so this is the box uh, right here, and you can see it's uh, recommended for J6 Craft and it's set 75197. And yeah, uh, comes with four mythics, uh, which are the First Order Gunner, the First Order uh, Shuttle Pilot, and two Executioner Troopers. And yeah, you got the Last Jedi uh, box uh, on the corner there, and yeah, uh, so on the side, uh, it does have the uh, the art uh, at the front of the box and yeah so the top shows you the actual uh, size for the first order execu executioner troopers and yeah so this is the back uh, it shows you all the features but, um, aside from that that's pretty much it for the box so uh, this is the instruction manual right here and uh, you can see this is the first page and uh, the final page of the build. You got this uh, battle of uh, crate scene type thing, and you got all the figures uh, from the same wave of uh, sets, and yeah, uh, you got uh, all the sets, and you got uh, Lego Life, and and also you got the parts list. But um, yeah, aside from that, uh, that's pretty much it for the instructions. So these are all of the extra pieces right here, and yeah, uh, as you can see, it comes with a lot of uh, red studs uh, for the figures' uh, studsters, and you got the this green one, and yeah, you got uh, some Technic pieces right here, and you got this studster piece, and uh, this cheese slope and uh, another one of these uh, Technic pieces with a stud on top and the last one is this extra uh, missile from this uh, for the spring loaded uh, shooter but uh, aside from that, that's pretty much it for all of the extra pieces so this is the first order uh, gunner figure right here and yeah so he's armed with his uh, stud shirt and yeah uh, this is just basically the uh, first order crew member just with his name change but yeah uh, so the helmet here is the exact uh, same you got a pretty nice mold there and you got the very normal uh, face under there not angry clone but yeah uh, the torso print uh, you, you just have uh, some very simple design and yeah it does look uh, pretty good but um, yeah uh, this is the back uh, you know just some linings and stuff but um, yeah aside from that that's uh, pretty much it for the first order gunner so the second figure here is the first order shuttle pilot and he is also armed with uh, the stutcher and yeah, uh, so he has this uh, helmet mode here, which uh, looks similar to the first order crew member. It's just that the front is uh, chopped off with uh, his face exposed. And yeah, I mean, um, it's a pretty cool piece. Uh, I believe this figure only comes in the uh, first order Star, De Star Destroyer set. So that's nothing great. And under the helmet, you can see you got the this very common face print with the microphone. But yeah, still nice to get. And the torso and the back torso, they are the exact same as the first order gunner. But um, yeah, aside from that, that's pretty much it. And the final figure here is the first order executioner troopers or the uh, storm Pepper executioner. Yeah, uh, so they are. Uh, so he's armed with uh, this um, stutcher piece, and he also has the this axe, uh, which has this uh, the element here, which is in blue. I'm not sure where I'm not sure where this uh, came from, but yeah, it's still definitely a very nice piece. And yeah, this is supposed to be the our axe, I guess. And you can turn this down to make it look more like an axe and yeah also there's uh, two of these figures in the set so yeah but um, the helmet here is a uh, new has some new printing so you have uh, this um, a black strip uh, going through here to uh, indicate that he is the uh, executioner trooper and yeah so the helmet is the I believe it is the exact same except for this line right here um, yeah, the original one is uh, very thick, and yeah, this one is thinner, but yeah, um, and under there, you can see you got the angry clone, and yeah, uh, so the torso printing, uh, not sure which 
part is the uh, different part but yeah I believe uh, these sides and uh, this top part uh, is the new printing with just they just have a little bit of a uh, black printing but yeah aside from that uh, the rest is the exact same of the ammunitions on the belt I guess and you got uh, the leg print thing with the uh, knee pad armor piece and yeah so this is the back is the exact same thing uh, so you have this uh, uh, life support system tough thing or this kind of pack and yeah uh, he has a uh, black uh, arms and yeah uh, here's a comparison uh, to the original uh, strong uh, original first order stormtrooper and yeah you can see the lines uh, you know they are different and yeah the torso they are pretty much the same uh, they just have some uh, black uh, detail but um, yeah so this is the back is the exact same and yeah but aside from that that's pretty much it for the first order executioner troopers so this is the turret build uh, right here and yeah so let's start with the bottom so the bottom here you got uh, the legs here which are posable you know you can make this thing into a different height and yeah it's on this uh, ratcheted or hinge piece and yeah, uh, the this the bottom here you got this transparent piece which uh, holds up the build if it's on this uh, if the legs uh, are on this level. So that's definitely great. And yeah, uh, and uh, the the entire turret here you can you know turn it around uh, 360 degrees, and that's definitely great. And yeah, so. Uh, here you got this uh, windshield right here without any windscreen but yeah and uh, to the and the seating area here uh, does not have any control panels or anything like that which does kind of suck but um, yeah uh, you know but it does have a clip which is definitely very useful and yeah it has some uh, red uh, translucent red pieces uh, around this build which just makes the build look nicer I guess but yeah uh, the figure uh, is not attached with any studs you know the uh, the figure is only attached with this modified piece and you got this back rest right here and the figure fits in there pretty nicely but yeah the figure is not in there very securely so yeah you do have to watch out for that but yeah uh, so the cannon here you can you know move it up and down you know you can aim it kind of but um yeah, you got uh, two of these uh, guns at the front, and yeah, uh, does have a little bit of a paneling, but um, yeah, the uh, and you also have uh, this spring-loaded missile, which fires uh, pretty nicely. But um, yeah, aside, aside from that, uh, like that's uh, pretty much it for the turret build. So overall conclusion of this set here. So how how do I think of it? Um, well, the figures, um, they are, uh, obvious, obviously, they are the main part of the battle pack, so, yeah, um, the gunner here, I think, um, he's just terrible, uh, he's, he's way too common, and they could have, uh, included another figure instead, like a first order officer, or a, uh, storm or something, yeah, that, that would have been much more nicer, but, um, yeah, it, it's just, um, yeah, this figure is, uh, such a waste, so yeah but um uh the shadow pilot here i think the sh shadow pilot is fine um you know the helmet mode is new but yeah uh, aside from uh the helmet mode uh the rest of the body they they are all uh, very common so yeah um maybe they could have made a different face for him or something uh to make him uh more exclusive but um yeah i mean the shadow pilot is fine and um Executioner, executioner troopers here. I think uh, they are great, and yeah, I like all the detailings, especially the one on the helmet. And yeah, I mean, um, they could have maybe they could have Im improved some prints on the figures, like uh, uh, maybe they could have included some uh, different uh, prints. But um, yeah, and uh, the weapon maybe they also could have changed it up a little bit. Uh, maybe you know include uh maybe use a different piece to build it or something but um yeah i mean the figures i think they are half good and half bad and the build i think this turret build is just way too terrible um you get a lot of uh, these 
kind of built in uh, battle packs. So yeah, uh, it's kind of getting boring. Uh, but um, yeah, they could have uh, you know made a like a troop transporter or something that uh, that that is maybe that's be better or a walker maybe. But um, yeah, the a turret is just way too boring. But yeah, I do like the spring loader shooters though. But um, yeah, I mean, uh, this set is a uh, okay set, but um, yeah, I mean, if you want these troopers, then yeah, I recommend you getting the the set here. So yeah, buying for the set down in the description box below, along with all my social media media pages down in the description. So if you like my channel, make sure to subscribe right here and watch more videos right here. So that's it for the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll be seeing you very soon.